it's Aaron from WPKB and in this video we're going to take a look at setting up the URL shortener in Easy Social Share buttons. Uh, just obviously starting in the configuration area for this particular plugin, we scroll down and in the left hand menu within the plugin itself we choose URL shortener. We've got three options that come with the plugin. We can use uh, WP Get Short Link, uh, Google's URL shortener or Bitly. Using WP Get Short Link is probably the most straightforward as there's really no additional setup required and it's already built into WordPress so you're not relying on an external service to use. So that's what we're going to use. To do that, all you need to do is click in the checkbox and then that will become the default setting uh, for everything in the plugin when it comes to short links. You can obviously use uh, Google or Bitly as we mentioned, but if you are using Bitly, you do need to have an account with them so you then input your username and your API key. And the final option you have with Bitly is to choose the j.mp domain uh, in Bitly. Of course, you can use whatever you're most comfortable with, whatever you uh, want to use with the Google service. You can also then go on to get some uh, data as well. Uh, but we're relying on the plugin here to collect the data about what's been shared, uh, you know, how many clicks and so on have uh, been made. But it does note that using short links will generate unique short links for pages and posts. If you shared anything up to the point in which you're about to change this setting, uh, the counters will start from zero. So just think about what you might be doing in the future. Make sure you're choosing what's best for you. And when you're done there, just hit update settings. Uh, and that's completely done now and saved. So if you have any questions about the short link options in this plugin, please feel free to ask in the comments below. Otherwise, if you've enjoyed the video, hit subscribe for more.